How's it going now, everyone? This is Mr. Frozen, and today I went to two stores today. First, I went to Hot Topic, and I got this. I think it's a wristband, but I'm not quite sure. I'm going to take it out of the box and see. Alright, so taking it out of the box, it is indeed a necklace. I got Freddy Fazbear. Hang on, let me put it on. Oh, shit. I like it. Alright, the next thing. Uh, well, after that, I went to Books A Million and I got this. Set one. I'll be getting set two. Okay, so set one has Chica and Mr. Cupcake, Foxy, Golden Freddy, animatronic skeleton. This set one. Set two has these guys, but I'll probably do that in the future. His name is on top. Oh yeah, by the way, it's a. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Yeah, here it is. It is. Owned by Scott. Shit. Hang on. Uh, you can't see if it says Scott Coffin. That's the creator of Finance and Freddy's. So what I'm going to do is open this and we're going to look at the figures. <coughs> okay, I took <clears throat> them out of the package and the first one we're going to look at is Chica. It's got some nice detail. Looks like the actual one from the game. And here's Mr. Cupcake. Which, the head, actually the head does turn. Uh, and now we're going to look at Foxy. Looks good. Except the feet are kind of together, but I'm going to have to fix that somehow. Wait, does the head move? I'm worried that I even touch this, but hang on. Yes, the head does move. Slightly, but it moves. Wouldn't fuck with it though, because it would probably break, so I'm not gonna risk it. Next one, Golden Freddy. It looks so cool, like in the sitting position. But, uh. Yeah, it just looks cool. Anyway, does his head move? Actually, judging by the looks of his head. Actually, I'm looking at the neck, and it does not move, so he's just a statue. And now, the last figure in Series 1 is the M a second endoskeleton. I want to call it that, because that's what it was called. It's, it's, it's called the animatronic skeleton, but let's call it Endo 2, because that's what it is. It looks like it's from Final Fantasy Freddy's 2, and it looks awesome. It's got detail on the back of it. Now, the question is, can it move its head? Yes, it can. Actually, if I'm just expecting it so that these figures only move by their head. That's the only place they can move. But anyway, that's the set one of the Finance of Freddy's figures from Fungo, Funko. If I get a second set, I will review that as well. So anyway, on to the last thing I got. The last thing I got was a Minecraft. <clears throat> and now, to be fair, I'm not, I never played the game. I just know it. But uh, I'm not really that much of a fan of Minecraft. But uh, I've seen it a bunch of times, so I decided to get it. So we're going to open this up and see how it goes out. Okay. Well, I got the shell off. It was a, it was a pain in the ass to get the thing off, getting the thing out. 
But uh, here's the Minecraft book. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention. Um, this is Series 1, and uh, it comes with Steve with the... Yeah. Anyway, uh, here's some other series with, like, the Enderman. Shit, hang on. The Enderman, another Steve, a Creeper, a Zombie, and that's probably it. They also come with accessories, but uh, I'm not really going to get to them. Collect them all. Probably not. Anyway. It cost $21. I had a bunch of money then. Okay. So, review. Uh, first, I'm going to sh show the bed. It's just a hunk of plastic stick. Yeah. Nothing. Hang on. <coughs> Sorry. Excuse me. That's a neat after this. Nothing major. It's just a hunk of plastic. But it could be used for, like, uh, some play thing. And, uh, we got a box. I think it, like, holds stuff. Does it open? Wait, does it open? It, it, it can open because I can see it. Oh, there we go. Yes, it does open. There's nothing in it. And, uh, here's, like, a tool tool thing. With some tools on it, but it's just a hunk of plastic again. Here's the, uh, accessories it comes, well, that's, well, what am I talking about? Uh, it also comes with, a uh, shit. It comes with a pickaxe. And, uh, it comes with a sword. Okay, now let's look at the figure itself. It does look like Steve. I will give it that. But it's weird that Steve has this, like, hands that holds. Anyway. Let's see. Moves head. Yeah, moves head. I want to say the head could pop off, right? Oh, it can. Okay, it's like a Lego figure. Does the arms pop off? No, they probably do not pop off, but I probably don't want to break it. It's got like uh, things in its hand so you can like hold the things. The legs move. Wait, can the legs pop off? Hang on, let me see. Yes, they can pop off. Okay. Anyway, let's see. Uh, okay, the problem is trying to get his hands over his head because it's so blocky. Uh, let's see. Uh, can we fit this? The thing is, can it fit? That's what I want to know. Yes, it can fit. Both hands, let's see. Yes, both hands. It can fit in both of his hands. So he can short fight and pick X for diamonds. Huh. Oh yeah, by the way, I also got some gummy bears, but I'm going to eat those for later. Anyway. Where should I place these things now? Hang on, let me think about it. Okay, uh, well, hang on. I need some light. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to. As you can see, I placed my. Okay, I placed my Steve figure right there. I put the accessories in the box and all that stuff. He's sitting on his bed, and I put my uh, FNAF figures with my little my little pony figures. So they'll be sitting there. The only thing is, it was really hard to make him. It was hard for Endo to stand up, so I had to lean him on something. Foxy looks like it's hard for him to stand up, but it's not. So, I'm gonna have to, like, do something. But anyway, I hope you guys like this review. And, uh, if I ever get any more stuff, I will show you it next time. But uh, until then, I will see you all later. Goodbye, G's.